gentlemen, I'm gonna cook for you the most delicious ever marry me chicken. This recipe is so easy, all in one pan. Okay, so the first step is to get a little bit of flavor in the chicken. A little bit of flour. We're almost gonna dust the chicken so it's gonna create like a little bit of a crust and the paprika. Okay, and the paprika, it's almost like that feel of peri peri chicken. A little bit of the salt and a tiny bit of pepper. Now, before we start doing this, I'm gonna put the pan on. So we're gonna start achieving a little bit of heat. Now, give a little bit of mix. You can use a little fork. There you go, just all beautiful. And this as well is gonna help the sauce to get a little bit of thickness. Everything happens just in one pan. Just like that, absolutely stunning. Now, a little bit of heat in the pan. And we're gonna use a little bit of olive oil and a little bit of butter. The olive oil is gonna avoid to that solid or the butter to burn. Okay, so make sure you give a little bit of a swell so the butter is melting. You get the nice bubbles. So make sure you get the pan nice and done. Just take your time with this, okay? Look at all the frothy bubbles. Yes, nice. We're gonna start to give it just a little bit of color. We're just gonna cook the outside until everything gets nice and caramelized. Oh, look at this. Come on, and yes. We don't wanna cook all the way through. Slightly sear it. And you should have a little tray ready to go to just rest the breast and we can build the sauce, okay? That's what you want. You see the breast slowly is holding together, but it's still raw in the middle. This smell unbelievable, toasty paprika. Now let's build the sauce, okay? So now we've got the beginning of a beautiful sauce in here. We're gonna do a little bit of garlic, a little bit of chili, and some onion. And that's just, with a little bit more butter, we're just gonna slightly build the lovely sauce. And the onions are gonna start to be nice and soft and caramelized. Get all the chopped onion. Just one onion, really simple. I'm gonna do a little bit of garlic. Just thinly slice, just for a lot of caramelization. A little pinch of chili. Don't go too crazy, too loco with that. It's gonna give that a little bit of a stir. And it's gonna take a couple of minutes until the onions get really nice and soft. Okay, and they turn sweet. Something magic happens. This is the key ingredient for marimi chicken. The sun-dried tomatoes and you're just gonna give them roughly chopped. So, the secret of this, never put them whole. And, oh, this is amazing. A little bit of paprika. I'm gonna put the oregano. And this one all the way, the way from Greece. But you can use fresh wine. What I love about this, is look at this. We put the stock and the beautiful cream. And that's when we build the sauce, ready? The secret of this is salt cooking with just one pan. Just one pan. Look at the color of that, look at that. Absolutely amazing. Parmesan is gonna give you that nuttiness. This is slightly gonna melt, mix it all up. You're gonna have a little gentle ooh, bath in the lovely sauce. We're gonna finish that with a little bit of fresh parsley and a little bit of nice citrus zest, okay? A little bit of lemon. We're gonna use the lemon on the board before we cut in half. Oh, and that start to simmer, the lemon use, the citrus zest, you got the cream, oh, incredible! And now, what we're gonna do, eight minutes, gentle simmering, and it's something really amazing. I would just keep basting the chicken breast with that sauce. Okay, so now when the chicken is cooking, I'm gonna clean up a little bit and get ready to plate. Okay, stop. Now, look at the sauce. The thickness in the sauce is amazing. Now, we're gonna put a little bit more of the oregano just because this is amazing and the fragrance is fantastic. And I'm gonna do a little bit of roughly chopped parsley. Just because the parsley is just gonna give that nice green color. I mean, who, who will not marry you? Look at this. Sometimes we are scared if the chicken breast is cooked all the way or not, okay? 
Don't worry about it too much. You can put it on the board and just nicely turn it around like this. And just carve it beautifully. Hold it with the tongs. Oh, look at that. OMG! Get the plate ready. Let's do it in one go. This is crispy parmesan potatoes and a little bit of salad and drencher in sauce. It's gonna be the most delicious. I mean, this is a great recipe. Get a bit of lettuce in there. Come back to the pan and just be generous. Get a little bit of that sauce. I mean, you got four breasts and all this sauce. So don't be shy now with the sauce. Drench it. And now, <laughs> it's that time when we get to taste it. Absolutely amazing. Look at that, falls off. Just sauteed them. Just one question. Will you marry me, chicken? <laughs> if you want recipes like this and plenty more, all you have to do is go to stockland.com.au slash food. Oh, so good.